National Coast Watch Center or NCWC with its support agencies conducted an interagency exercise called Alalayan 2023 at the Manila Bay earlier today, August 11. The Philippine Coast Guard or PCG showcased some of its assets such as the BRP Malapascua, BRP Melchor Aquino and Chopper. Other agencies including the Philippine Navy, Philippine National Police Maritime Group and Bureau of Quarantine also used their assets during the said activity. But NCWC Director Coast Guard Vice Admiral Roy Echeverria said it is not a show of force. The exercise was just a demonstration of how the combined agencies will respond to maritime threats or incidents and test their communication capability. No, this is not a show, of course, of course, of course. Uh, this is just a, an exercise to test our interoperability among the, the, the different uh, support agencies of the National Coast Watch Center. And also, uh, because the EU actually uh, provided us with a, with a uh, secured, common information uh, sharing platform, from what I've seen, it, it, it ran all very smoothly. I mean, uh, it seemed that the agencies were really playing well together. And they were moved. Uh, they moved together. They were communicating well. And so I think the exercise went to went quite well. Echeverria further said the use of water cannon to suppress a fire incident in a foreign ship has no connection over the recent water cannon attack by the Chinese Coast Guard against PCG boat at Ayungin Shoal. The exercise was conceptualized several months ago before the incident in the West Philippine Sea occurred. Wala naman pong kilalaman yun. But uh, it's always good to be prepared for any eventualities. And, uh, you know, we keep training our personnel. Dante Amento, UNTV, News and Rescue. We serve the people. We give glory to God.